वेलकम टू इंग्लिश इन न्यूज दिस इज रत्नाकर विद इंग्लिश बुलेटिन The news in details. With coronavirus cases rising in Nagpur, District Guardian Minister Nitin Raut and State Home Minister Nil Deshmukh in a meeting with Nagpur Municipal Corporation and Nagpur City Police have agreed that a complete lockdown with a total curfew can break the chain of corona spread. Though no date have been finalized yet, a 14 days complete lockdown with a total curfew is likely to be imposed in the city probably from the last week of July as agreed upon by all ministers and officials present at the meeting. Leaders of opposition parties were not invited for the meeting. NCP MLC Prakash Kajbe and Shiv Sena MP from Ramtek were the other netas present at the meeting. Thousands of people have died in the entire country due to the corona epidemic. Even in Nagpur, the coronavirus has killed many people. Coronavirus is knocking at all places. It may be home or shop or maybe in office. Keeping this in mind, sanitation was done with a thermal fogging machine in this BCN news channel also. BTP Yatra and the office of Vagoba Nagari, this work done to prevent corona infection is definitely important as a precaution. It should be done everywhere. On Sunday a patient died while undergoing treatment at Gilurkar Hospital. The family of the deceased has accused the hospital and said that till date lakhs of rupees have been looted in the name of a treatment. They alleged that the doctor of the hospital is a butcher in the name of God. According to the information the name of the deceased is the Shiva Narayan. He have, he was met with an accident after which he was admitted to the hospital for treatment. Well, the treatment was not done properly and he died due to which the family is sad and angry at the negligence of the hospital civic chief tukaram munde has stated that the nmc sponsor study was found correlation between the encroachment of nala and gutter lines to be the biggest cause of flood in the city the civic chief has warned to strict action against such encroachments Unchecked construction and encroachment on Nala Alt is the true sense creating a flooding several areas of the city when heavy rains occur the residential area near Nala is often its worst victim the flooding of residential areas has become a serious issue for Nagpur city at the present and the nmc has received a plethora of complaints in this regard based on the complaints the commissioner has constituted committee headed by additional commissioner ram joshi superintendent of water supply department shweta banerjee and other officials to study the issue additional commissioner of police dr nilesh parne will be acting as a commissioner of police in the absence of commissioner of police dr bhushan kumar padai who has gone on leave Barney is a native of nagpur after being appointed as an ips officer he got uttarakhand cadre Barney uh, was posted as a deputy commissioner of police in Nagpur on deputation 4 years ago. Initially he was assigned to a special branch. He then took charge as the deputy commissioner of police for circle 4. From there he was transferred as a deputy commissioner of transport branch. Seeing Barney's aggressive working style Dr. Pada appointed him as the deputy commissioner of police crime branch within 2 weeks. 6 month later he was promoted to additional commissioner of police crime branch. A 10 year old boy was swept away in the nala due to disbalance. This incident happened on Sunday afternoon. The name of the boy is Nehal Shekhar Mishra. He is a resident of Gulmohar Nagar. According to the information Nehal was crossing the nala where Lakshmi Nagar Paratwada Kalamna area. Then his balance was disturbed and he fell into the nala. The nala is joined with the Nadi. The fire department including three teams of Kalamna, Ganjipet and Sakkadara is also involved in the investigation. Where the incident took place, it's between 24 hours and still the team is searching for Nihal with the help of the boat and CFO team. Sahil Sayed, the man accused in the ongoing honey trap case in Nagpur, has been arrested by the Nagpur Crime Branch Police. Police have arrested him after knowing that he was staying at his residence in Mankapur area. Sahil Sayed is accused of trying to trap Nagpur Mayor Sandeep Joshi and senior BJP corporator Dayashin Kutiwari in a honey trap. He was also wanted by the police in cases of fraud and embezzlement. Crime Branch Police have arrested him after knowing that he was at home. With the addition of 68 new coronavirus cases on Monday the tally in Maharashtra's Nagpur district mounted to 3037 with the two more patients succumbed in the day the fatality count has gone up to 55 including 38 deaths from the city and the rest 17 from the district an official release said 
A total of 58 patients were discharged in the day, taking the total count of the recovered cases to 1,939, it said. Nagpur district now has 1,033 active cases. Today's positive cases were reported from various hospitals. As we know, the COVID-19 pandemic is increasing rapidly in the city. In view of the situation, only one person on a two-wheeler, while only three people on a four-wheeler have been allowed. Due to the gravity of the situation traffic, police is keeping a strict awakening and a checking vehicles everywhere. As per information on Saturday, the traffic department took action against 820 drivers and imposed a fine. And on Sunday, also the traffic police resumed the action at a Reserve Bank Square, Modesty Point Square and Rahati Colony Square. The commuters are also complained that the police is not understanding their problems and they are unable to buy another two-wheeler or car or to take their families away. A case of hiring by some unknown on Meshram couple has come up in a Shivaji ground campus on Kalmeshwar. The incident took place around 11.30 on a Monday morning. Both husband and wife have been injured in this accident. The incident is suspected to be due to an old controversy. Police are searching for the accused. According to the information, Ganesh Meshram, aged about 32, and Priyanka Meshram, aged about 24, live in a Sudhakar Kade's house on a rent. Some unknown people fired on them and escaped. Ganesh was shot in the stomach during the fire and was seriously injured. He was shifted to Government Hospital Nagpur for further treatment. The incident has stirred the area. The number of accused is stated to be six. As soon as the information was received, Tanedar Maruti Muluk, along with the team, reached the spot. The Mishnam couple is a native of Jaitala, Nagpur and had been living in Kalmeshwar for two years. That's all from this bulletin. For more details about city and around, stay tuned with NBC News. Till then, Ratnakar says goodbye. Please stay safe and be healthy.